All right, guys, I know this is what most of you have been waiting for. Black Ops 2 Zombies. We're all in amazing suits of amazingness right now, and we're about to play some zombies. Starting off with a pistol. I don't know where I'm going to take stand. Somewhere right here is good. And uh, so apparently... This is supposed to be even better than the last zombie, so let's see. Oh my gosh, they're like possessed with blue eyes now, sweet. I should have let him defeat the barrier, I don't know why I did that. But that was a quick round. We're at the bus depot, or depot, <laughs> depot. I guess, uh, I think it's depot, right? Right? It's not depot, it's like Home Depot, not depot. I always thought about that, you know, like, why isn't it called Home Depot? So every time I go there, I'm like, bomb, we're going to Home Depot, aren't we? Whatever. Alright, so I'm gonna let him destroy the uh, barrier so I can get some money. I guess the people don't understand what I'm doing, apparently. So, what happened? I have enough money to get a new gun, but I really don't feel like it. I kind of want to save up. I really like the map already. I like how you start off in this really tiny place. I'm not going to get a gun yet either because I don't need one. Then destroy the barrier a little bit. Start shooting them every once in a while. Oh crap. Alright. Not a ammo. Okay, I didn't really plan on buying a gun, but I totally ran ammo. What is that? Let him destroy the barrier a little bit. These are just techniques. You should do this if you want to level up. Just make sure you can uh, kill him really quick. Like for this gun, as long as you headshot them, they're dead, basically. See, this is where you gotta start shooting them because they're gonna break through the barrier now. And that's how you gain easy money. Man, only if life was this easy. Shoot some zombies, get a barrier. How do you tell your ammo? Is there an ammo? Oh, I'm stupid. I'm retarded. Oh, did they open the door yet? No. Oh. Apparently the people don't know what knife is, so I had to tell them that. I'm just kind of having some fun. There we go, that's good. I need some more ammo. Alright. I would not survive in this. In real life, gosh, this is horrible. I would not want to play zom or be a zombie or fight zombies. I don't see how people turn into the zombies, but like I've always thought, you know, like, kind of like a vampire. 
Like if they bite you, you turn into a zombie. But then again, like in all these movies, when you get bitten, you're just eaten. You know what I mean? I don't really get that. Like, I, I guess you just have to get hit by the virus, but how did everybody else get hit by the virus but you? You know what I mean? That's just my terminology there. It's just my, whatever. <laughs> I, I still, I, I remember this, I don't remember the story on this exactly, so if anybody wants to refresh me on the story, and if there's something new compared to this one, you know? Because I know it was like people were time traveling, and something happened, and everybody turned into zombies. And I know how the dogs are there, and the little girl was there and stuff, but I just don't exactly remember. I'd like if someone refreshed me. Refresh me in the comments or something, guys. Oh my gosh. Getting some easy money, dude. This is really fun. I never, I've never really been, enjoyed zombies. Like, um, World at War was actually the only one I enjoyed. I did not enjoy Black Ops at all, just because the gameplay on the game, I just hated the gameplay on the game. That's the only reason why I didn't enjoy Zombies. I just didn't like how everything operated. Now, this game is a little different, apparently, because I like it. I played the multiplayer. In fact, I'm rendering a multiplayer video right now, and I think the game, the multiplayer is great. It's a, there, there's a, there's a few problems that you probably need to work on, but I wasn't playing on hardcore mode. So I feel like that they're gonna get fixed pretty soon, and we open the door, so let's get out of here. Oh, I need to get ammo. Oh no, mystery box is way better. Is this like open zombies? I was about to say. Let's see what I get. Come on, get something good. That'll work. Oh jeez. That'll work. Oh god. We should have not opened the door. We should have not opened that door, guys. Oh my gosh. That saved our butts. That totally saved us. Alright guys, be careful. Seriously, be careful. Please don't noob it anymore. Be careful. Yeah, we should not open those doors at all. Everybody knife, it's insta-kill. Just knife. Don't waste ammo on these nubs. Okay, so apparently if a zombie gets in fire, it blows up. So don't let it get in fire. That's not good. Where's like the barricades? And oh, crap, there we go. Gosh.
the grass is always green to walk a mile in my shoes what's a one dollar finish to a million dollar move one more than just a cliche to get me through the day but i get mad at myself because i can find the words to say the grass is always green to walk gosh dang it guys you guys shouldn't have stayed in here don't stay in here start crawling out we need help him Yeah, dude, come on, no noob in it. Oh, dude, you're a pro at the noobing. Well, that was eight rounds of alrightness. Good game, guys, good try. And uh, that was actually pretty fun. I can't wait to play more and get better at it. So I'll catch you guys later. And remember to subscribe and watch your number three best Call of Duty Black Ops 2 commentator.